हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू एफएसटी ऑनलाइन द चैनल ऑफ फूड साइंस एंड टेक्नोलॉजी हियर वी विल ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड अबाउट हार्वेस्टिंग एंड पोस्ट हार्वेस्ट प्रोसेसिंग ऑफ असाफोइटेडा असाफोइटेडा इज अ इंग्रेडिएंट which we usually consumed as a spice in our day to day life this is the image it is of yes you are correct it is of asafoetida botanical name of asafoetida is ferula asafoetida which belongs to the family ambeniferi in hindi and marathi it is usually known as hing so what is this asafoetida it is the dried latex or oleo gum or gum oleo resin exuded as a very thick and sticky and pasty sap or latex from the living underground rhizome or root stock or tap root of several species of ferula the image here is of ferula plant now where do we obtain this ferula from the main growing areas of asafoetida are the eastern parts of iran and the western part of afghanistan and some part of turkey also this asafoetida is acrid and bitter in taste and emits a strong disagreeable pungent aliceous odor due to the presence of sulfur compounds therein natural asafoetida in its concentrated form has a very strong flavor which is more commonly disagreeable and because of it its common name in abroad is devil's dung so how this asafoetida is harvested the asafoetida plant have massive tap root or a carrot shaped root almost 12.5 to 15 cm in diameter at the crown portion means at the top portion when they are of 4 to 5 years old here is the image from which we can get an idea how the root of asafoetida plant look like after that the rhizome produce two plants one of which is male plant producing in florescence that is flowers and the other female plant which has only foliage means leaves and no inflorescence at all here is the image from which we can get an idea that the asafoetida rhizome gives two different plants one is male plant and other one is female plant so male plant having the inflorescence and female plant having only leaves that is foliage only female plant produces asafoetida the in march and april just before the plants flower upper part of the leaving rhizome or the root which is almost 5 to 6 cm is laid bare and stem is cut off close to the crown means we are cutting off the stem portion and allowing the root to be exposed as it is the exposed surface is then covered by a dome shaped structure which is 15 to 20 cm high called as khora which is made up of twigs and clay and which has an opening towards the north so this is the plant from which we are cutting the stem portion allowing the root to get exposed over the root we are building a khora or dome shape like structure and keeping it open from the north side then a milky juice exudes from the cut surface after some days 
the exudate is scraped off and a fresh slice of root is cut when more latex exudes. Sometimes the resin is removed along with the slice. The collection of the resin and the slicing of the root are repeated until exudation stops about three months after the first cut. This process after winter is over and the spring sets in. Sprouts come out from the rhizomes of the female plant and the put for foliage. After at most one month, green foliage of female plant turn yellow. At this stage, the rhizome of the female plants are tapped for saffoetid. This is the image from where we can get an idea that how the latex is exudating from the stem, how it is collected and thereof. How, which are the processed products of Asafoetida? As like other spices, oil of Asafoetida is again most important processed product. It is obtained by steam distillation of gum resin. Steam distillation means boiling Asafoetida in a boiling water and collecting the volatile oil by condensation. That is your oil of Asafoetida. The chief constituent of the oil is secondary butyl propenyl disulfide. Another processed product of asafoetida is compounded asafoetida powder and tablets. Compounding is necessary in order to dilute its flavor because natural asafoetida have very concentrated harsh flavor. So we are diluting it by compound asafoetida powder preparation. How it is prepared? Equal quantity of starch and gum are mixed in a mixer. The pasty mass of asafoetida is soaked in required quantity of water and this slurry is added to the above and mixed well. More gum is added and mixing continued in the mixer. The compounded asafoetida is then powdered in a mill and then packed as such or after making tablets. What are the uses of asafoetida? Yes, asafoetida is extensively used in India for flavoring curries, sauces, and pickles. It is used as a stimulant, carminative. Carminative means which gives reliefs from flatulence, expectorant, and antispasmodic. It stimulates intestinal respiratory tracts and the nervous system also. Asafoetida is useful in asthma, moving cuff and chronic bronchitis. Asafoetida oil has antibiotic properties and inhibits growth of microbes. So hope you have understood all about Asafoetida. Let us recap it by having some quiz. So which plant part of ferula is used as spice? Options are unopened bud, bark, leaves, and latex. Yes, correct answer is latex. Now have second question. Which is the chief flavoring compound of asafoetida? Options are eugenol, crocinin, Butyl propenyl disulfide or allyl propyl disulfide? Yes, correct option is butyl propyl disulfide. Hope you have understood all about asafoetina. Thank you.